Hello, hello, welcome back. This is episode five, season three of Telltale's The Walking Dead. We are playing as Javier, and we are, um, we've just saved our brother David from being hung, although things have gone to shit. Uh, Kate, we think Kate might be dead. She drove in with the van, which got molotov which then crashed, leaked petrol everywhere. Looks like it blew up, but might have been the truck that blew up, I'm not sure. Fingers crossed she's not dead. Um, and I, I don't know if that was always the case. Um, Ava's also dead. Um, I, I do wonder, we, we had a choice to save Trip or to save Ava. I chose to save Ava, but she got executed. So I do wonder if I'd have chosen Ava to get executed, whether she still would, uh, yeah, I don't know. But, um, yeah, we, we're just going to uh, we're going to jump straight into it. And continue, episode five. Previously, on The Walking Dead. Whatever this... thing is between us, I want to give it a chance. And I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more... complicated. But... do you feel the same way? I'm in. All the way. Oh my god, really? Really? Just look what he's done. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend, Eleanor, last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? Fuck Eleanor. We did. Bitch. You've put me in a no-win situation here. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However... Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. Let Ava live. Shoot her. Wait! I said don't shoot Ava! How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? We're leaving. All of us. Right now. Uh. It's Kate. She's coming for us. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Kate might have been flung out the front window and be alive in the distance somewhere. Here we go. While we're still breathing, Javi, I'm letting the bones speak to me. <laughs> oh my God. Ooh. I think I can hear them. They're saying, you're gonna lose, come mierda, so play already. I must have inherited patience from Ma. Oh, come on, man. Uh. Calm down, David. No one is ever in a rush to lose. Victoria. Carajo, I was so close. Uh. You're now my least favorite son, Javier. <laughs> hey, he's the one who beat you. Fine. It's a tie. I hate you both equally. Kicked out of baseball. Can't play dominoes. What exactly are you good at again, Javi? At least I can actually play baseball. Slugger. That's enough, both of you. It's not Javi's fault he's a disgrace to the game of dominoes. I won. That's ten bucks you owe me. Both of you. I know you're broke, Javi. You should sit out the next game since we all know I'm gonna win. 
No shame in surrender. You got lucky. We'd all understand. Don't kid yourself. You got lucky. <sighs> Fuck luck. No skill. Pay up, little brother. If you can. I'll cover for Javier. Oh, is it your turn to do that now? I lost track. Poor, helpless Javi. Get my wallet, mijo. Keep an eye on him. You don't want him snatching an extra 20 for gas money. It's on the counter. Yeah, sure, Pa. Pa? What's this? Hey, man, I was reading that. What? Wait, what's up? What the fuck is this? None of your business. He has cancer. What? Bob, really? I'm old. Old people get cancer. You didn't need to know. That's not for you to decide. You really should have told us. It's the right thing to do. It's my cancer. I get to do whatever I want. You know now. What difference does it make? How bad? It's okay, mijo. Ask me. How bad is it? You won't have to worry about paying me back that ten bucks. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Pa. I settle, David. Now. You haven't told Mama. And neither will either of you. You hear me? Mouth shut. That's not okay, Pa. You have to tell her. When the time is right, I, I will. That's not good enough. It's good enough for me. You're gonna need her help with this, Pa. Driving you to the doctor, getting prescriptions. Wait, what are your options? Treatment, stuff like that. Chemo, radiation, all that expensive mierda. Great, when do you start? I turned it down. Turned it down? You don't get to turn it down. So much money and for what? Another month, another game of dominoes to lose? It's not worth it. If I was still playing ball, I could have paid for it. I'll pay for it. It's not happening. Save your money. Fuck the money, I can afford it. You can afford it, David. But my pride can't. Let's play another game. You are a fucking coward! A selfish coward! Javi, can you believe this shit? David, I get it, man. It's not fair, but come on, take it easy. Sit down. Both of you. You know, I pray for daughters. <laughs> Every night your mother was pregnant with both of you. Please, God, a daughter. Anything but a son. Anything but another me. Anything but another hot-headed idiot with his heart in the right place. Anything but another foolhardy, handsome gambler. Anything at all. Please, Papa. Don't give up. Fight. Fight for our name. For our blood. For our family. Please, fight. You have to fight, Pa. We don't just give up, any of us. Okay. Okay? Okay. I'll think about it. Oh, thank you, Pa. Thank you, Javi. Now can we play another game? I'll grab some more beers. So, what are you really gonna do? Truth be told, Whatever gets your mother off my ass. You think you two were mad at me for keeping secrets? Hm. But it's good to see you and David on the same side of things, or a change. I'm gonna be a name carved in stone before you know it, Javier. That'll be me. Letters on a rock that nobody wants to visit. I know you think you're strong enough to handle that alone. And so does your brother. And you're both wrong. You have to take care of each other. You two are all I'll leave behind, like Gabe and Mariana will be for David. Legacy, Javier. It's all anyone leaves behind. That and their bones. 
be brothers before it's too late. That's not too much to ask. One last favor for your old man? Okay, Pa. I'll try. As hard as you can? As... as hard as I can. I still need to pay, David. Pa. Oi, if you had just won the game, we wouldn't have had this problem. <laughs> so you're <laughs> blaming me for all this. I'm depending on you, mijo. We both are. Got really good writing, I'll give it that. Kate! Kate! The door's wide open. Kate! I don't think it was open before. Harvey, we've got this. Eat, eat, eat. Oh! It's gonna be a cute. Oh! The bat, the bat! In there. Kate! Did she get flung from the vehicle? Kate! Kate! Gabe! David! Over here! Where's Kate? She's not here. She must have gotten out. If something's happened to her, if you've gotten her. Help me find her. You better hope she's alive. Shut up! for once and help me find her. What do you think I'm doing? Kate! 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 David, wait! Is that Kate? It's not her, is it? No, it's not. Just a woman. Oh, who is that? I found you. <laughs> How the I'm fuck so did you get out of the vehicle? Thank God you're all right. We saw you. I'm just glad you're still in one piece. So happy you're alive. Thanks for making it back to me. You're alive. I thought I lost you back there. The same. He's angry. What the hell's the matter with you two? Focus on your surroundings. Uh, there's Gabe and Clem. Lead the way, Javi. And a swing. Get the knee, like this. Nice. I got a great teacher. You guys all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Look at them! There's so many! We'll be safer inside! Get in! <sighs> I thought they might throw the old bait and switch. Kate wasn't really dead. That should hold them for now. You put up a good fight out there. I don't care what you think. Gabriel, do not take that tone with me. Ooh. You murdered that man after they let you go. You're a killer. Just like they said. You did that? You don't understand. It was them or us. I had to do it. 
They would never let us go. They still would have killed us. Sooner or later. Wasn't necessary. They were negotiating with us, David. Doing that to Clint wasn't necessary. That's how you see it. I would do it again. His brains splattered all over me. You are my son. I am doing what any parent would do to keep you safe. You do not get to judge my actions. Do you hear me? Hey, you do not walk away from me. When someone speaks to you, you stand up and answer them. David, that's enough. He's not a little boy. He doesn't need that from you. What he needs is to learn to keep his opinions to himself until he understands what the hell he's talking about. I'm just... I'm trying to protect you, Gabe. I lost you once. I won't let it happen again. Okay? We made it through alive. Let's just be glad about that. We need to check the other entrances. Make sure we're safe. Gabe, want to help me out? Javi? Gabriel. It's up to you, dude. I'll help you. I'll help you, Gabe. Let's go. No. We don't need you. I'll help too. O okay. Hey, Clem's with them. It's fine. It's not that. It's... let's just... <sighs> I'm all over the place. I need to focus on something. Anything. Just need to focus. Focus on... on whatever. See who made it through. Let's see if there are any other survivors. It'd be good to know who's still around. I don't want to think about how many people may have just died. <sighs> but I guess I'm going to have to find out eventually. Let's go. Mariana didn't live to see this. To see what her father's become. To see what I've done. She'd be just like that little boy. Scared that the monsters are coming after her next. She would never trust us again. You're no monster. And I wouldn't blame her. Kate, come on. We're not monsters. I don't know who we are anymore. But it's not the people she knew. did this to them. That hole is there because of me. I'm responsible too. This is all my fault. I'm just as responsible for it as you are. You weren't behind the wheel, Javi. It's different. I can't leave until I make this right. All of this. Let's fix this How? as best we can. Wasn't expecting that. Really? I thought you hated this place. All you've tried to do is get out. These people, they didn't ask for this. Just like we didn't ask to lose Mariana. We couldn't do anything about that. But maybe we can do something about this. Episode 5, From the Gallows. You've got a lot of nerve showing up here after the bullshit you pulled. Fuck you. You're unbelievable. How dare you. Oh, oh, I've got a lot of nerve. Everything that happened is because of you. This is all your fault. I told you, I wanted you out of my life after what you did to Conrad. Why did you tell Joan what we were doing? I was triaging a bad situation. Their doctor is barely functioning. And before you guys fucked it all up, their walls worked. It's not only about me. I can actually save lives here. Not just stitch them up and hope for the best. These people will die without me, Javi. 
I know she, well, fucked us over, but she's trying to help them. She's trying to make something right. Still a bit. That's worth forgiving, right? She's trying. That counts. She's doing a good thing now, but she's got a long way to go before I forgive her. <laughs> You're one to talk. We should try to help. Not everyone here is guilty. Fern. Is that you, darling? I'm here, handsome. Fern and Rufus. What's wrong with him? Bitten. He's slipping in and out of delirium. We have to find Ida. We have to find our daughter. I know that guy. We had a situation. He's lucky I didn't shoot him. Looks like his luck just ran out. Let them have a minute. It's the least we can do. Y'all get over here. You gotta cut his arm off. It's too far along. I'm sorry. Bullshit. It can work. I've seen it. Do you want his last moments alive to be more painful than they need to be? I just want to try. I can't lose everyone. Please. I'm begging you. Please. I'll try. I'll try. Hand over that axe. Thank you. Don't thank me yet. Sorry, dude. Ooh. One clean shot. Quick! Get the wrap something around it. Stop the bleeding. Eleanor? Doctor? No? You just can stand there and watch. No. 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 Good job, Eleanor. He was too far along. The bloodlust didn't help either, I'm sure. I'm sorry. Then you should have done something right. about it. <laughs> so what can I do? What the- We're all fucking dead because of you! Hey, easy. You We're... blew a hole in our wall! Got my little girl killed! Got my whole fucking family killed! Richmond was fine until your stupid Easy ass showed up. We're dead fucking meat, David. Might as well take out this asshole while I can. Fern. Shut up! Put it down. You don't want to hurt anyone. But it was my baby! Stand down. That's an order. Kate, no! Fern, this is all because of me. I caused the explosion. I killed your daughter. Please, forgive me. It's my fault. Please. Please, forgive both of us. <sighs> oh. No! Burn! Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah! You're welcome, Javi. That dead guy! David, what are you doing? This isn't right. David! Oh my god. She wasn't gonna shoot. Believe me, she was. Because I would have. She's you, is she? Oh, uh, yeah. No! David! Dave! I, I, I'm sorry, that was an accident. You were going to kill her. She was going for her gun. Look at her. Dave, I'm... She can't even stand up. What the hell is wrong with you? It was over the line, Gabe. You're right. Gabe. David, David, David. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to do that to you. You know that. Why the hell are you all looking at me that way? They're just... They're scared, David. Of what? I'm protecting them. Why are you pointing a gun at us? So I'm all alone. Fine then. You people are on your own. 
That's right. Walk out again. Such an asshole. I've seen that look in his eyes before. You should go after him. Do we have to? David? What are you doing? Don't do anything rash. Step back from there. Come on. Just take a step back. You wouldn't want to, you know, slip or something. Come over here. Or are you afraid of me too? I know the rest of them are. Right? Even if they are, I'm not. I've dealt with scarier than you, brother. There's no if, Javi. They are. My wife, Javi, my son, they look at me differently. Maybe you're seeing them differently. I want to show you something. Stand with me. I'm going to trust him. That's a long way down. Uh, why the hell are you smiling? See that sewer line over there? Perfect placement for a trench. That hill about a hundred paces west of it. Sniper's wildest dream come true. I'm a soldier, Javi. I see this landscape like a painter sees a blank canvas. Like how you used to see a baseball diamond. I'm a soldier. This makes sense to me. I was made for this. I thrive in this. Baseball was a lifetime ago. I miss it so fucking much. When I wasn't deployed, I'd miss being out in the field. Now that's all I am. Every day. A soldier isn't a husband. Or a father. A soldier is a soldier. Nothing else. Nothing. Nothing at all. Call yourself whatever you want. I still see you as my brother. That is kind of you to say, Javi. I wish... I wish I had your heart sometimes. I want to change, Javi. I always have. Really? All you ever tried to do was get me to change. <sighs> Only because I couldn't bring myself to do it first. It's the one war I could never win. And I'm wondering why. Is it because... I don't know how, or because it's impossible to change who you really are. There's always a way. Maybe you can't. You don't need to. There's a way. There always is. No matter how lost you are, you just have to keep looking until you find it. Looks pretty messy. For now. Maybe you're right. Maybe. Just gotta live long enough to find out. Just like with anything else. I did what you asked. You did. Thanks for that. So now will you step back? <laughs> sure. I found them! They're up here! Be careful, Javi. I ran into... It's a trip. He was still outside when we checked on the entrances. The muertos were everywhere. We got him inside just in time. So we let him in. There were so many muertos out there. Thank God you're okay, man. I I was worried. Uh, trip. About earlier. Yeah, about that. I ain't gonna punch you in the teeth. Though, I got every right. Really? Figured you'd put up a little bit of a fight. Oh, I'd love nothing more, but... I just... Can't shake this slippery feeling I got. Like I'm standing in shoes that don't quite fit. You picked me to die, and someone else did instead. Ain't sitting right, not one bit. 
I don't know what to tell you, man. It was... fucked up. No doubt. Top to bottom. I keep putting myself in your position. About Conrad, about all of this. Asking myself over and over again whether I'd do the same. I'd love to tell you I wouldn't. I really would. But I can't. If someone threatened my family, I'd shoot them in a heartbeat. Hell, I'd shoot them twice to make sure the lesson stuck. It's a complicated world. But at least there's people to share it with. Bygones? How about it? Bygones. I'm in if you are. I'm lucky to know you, Trip. You're a good man. Try not to piss me off again, please. Oh, I'm glad we made up. There's so many. They're pouring in. It's even worse than you think. The streets are overrun. Nowhere to go except inside the buildings, and those smelly fuckers are beating down every door. We're sitting goddamn ducks here. Everyone in town is. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck have we done? So what do we do? I don't want to die up here. None of us do, Gabe. Uh, we make this right. Stabilize the city. Figure out how to make it safer for everyone. I saw construction vehicles when we got the armored truck. We can use those to stop the Muertos, seal the breach, and save Richmond. That's over by the motor pool at the water tower. We could use the highway overpass to get to the water tower. Come on. Let's jump. <laughs> oh no, Come this on. is like season one all again. Jump. Who are we going to lose? <clears throat> Not Ben. Poor Ben. Okay, it's safe. Everyone made it. Keep your eyes open. Stay aware of your surroundings. All of you. Let's move out. When we found Kate earlier, she hugged you. Why do you think she hugged you? i got to fess up. Why was that? Just wondering. She likes me more. That can only mean one thing. She likes me more. Not a great time to joke around, Avi. Is that the we guy that stabbed us the other day? Or else the exact same thing will happen to us. Stay sharp and do not fire your guns. We're gonna be fine. That guy was all alone. We're not. Yeah. Everyone hold back. Let Javi and I clear out these walkers. Just thought, what about AJ? Good to go. Let's move. You okay, bud? When I was little, Dad used to ask me what I wanted to be when I was a man. And I pointed him. He always liked that. I thought he was such a great guy. It would always make him smile. Every time. If he asked you again right now, would you say the same? He hasn't asked me yet. <laughs> Never be like your uncle. He told me that all the time. Don't be a man who relies on other people to solve your problems. Because then you're not a man at all. I used to think he was right. Not anymore though, Javi. I can only hope I grow up to be like you. So, you said here's that? hoping. Uh, thanks, Gabe. Oh, thanks, buddy. It means a lot. I'm sorry I never really said it before. I should have. 
Really, thanks a million. You're welcome, a million. You took such good care of me. Now we need to take care of Dad. He's the one that needs our help. We're gonna have to go around the side. There's barely any room. Oh, that car does not look secure. Well, no time to waste. Come on. You know, I didn't think there was much that could scare me anymore. And yet, here we are. Just goes to show you. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Life is full of surprise. I'm not just scared. I'm fucking terrified. I pressed it. I pressed the button. Oh, tri is Trip gonna die? Thanks, Trip. That was. No. Ah, fuck you, fuck stick. <laughs> Son of a goddamn. Fuck you, fuck stick. Is he bitten? This ain't nothing. Once we're back on the ground, that's when this shit's really gonna get scary. Got a bad feeling. Good lord. I fucking it's kidding. It's nasty down there. My god, it never ends. This shit is way too fucking dangerous. Amen to that. Still, though, I'll take dangerous to dead any day. We have to get across. Do you propose we do that? I know Gabe doesn't see it, but David really is trying to look out for him. He's not doing the best job, but no one gives you a rule book to raise a kid. And they sure as shit don't. There's just one thing I don't get, though. Did David really think he was helping AJ by letting him go? Why did he stop guarding him? Kids aren't easy. Parenting isn't easy. You give them all you got, they tell you it's not enough, but you love the little shits anyway. Come on, you must have learned that too. I did. That's what makes it even harder to understand, though. After you put in all that work, so much of your heart... AJ was a brat. He lived with me after we kicked you out, Clem. I'd already raised two kids. Thought it'd be a piece of cake. <laughs> Not with that tyrant. Is that why you gave him away? We had a bad winter. Destroyed every crop we had. I couldn't leave Richmond. And AJ couldn't stay in Richmond. I gave AJ to Lingard and told him to do whatever he had to to save his life. I miss that breath. So where is he? Where's AJ? Never asked Lingard about it again. Though I've wanted to. Often. Hmm. Don't think it doesn't haunt me. Not a day goes by where it doesn't. It wasn't easy, Clem. Remember, far as I knew, I'd already lost two children. It wasn't any easier with number three. It's never easy. I'm gonna keep you alive. Keep all of us alive. And hope that that's enough. Enough for atonement. No one survives by doing what their heart says. They survive by doing what their brain says. If that was his best chance to live, I get it. So how are we going to cross this gap? Holy shit. Chopped right in half. Oh. There's the other half. Ooh. 
So the water tower's over there. Um, look at what? Is that no part way of the we're bridge? jumping across that. It, does it want us to swim across on the uh, on the prop? Well, there's the water tower. Not too far away. Expect everyone to walk over it. It's that or go back. Oh, he's gonna swing on it. We should go lightest to heaviest. That way it won't break on the first swing. I'll go first, Clem. You calling Clem fat? Get a long run up, but not too long. If you take too many quick steps, you'll propel yourself upward instead of out. Same with your jump. Just Run off the end, don't leave. David. Try not to... He's got this. She's right. I do. for the kids to swing across, but us? You've got this. I've seen you do things that are way scarier. Okay. I can do it. Just believe. <sighs> believe, Kate. For God's sake, hold on. <sighs> Alright, David. You're up. You're the little brother. You should go first. Oh, you're definitely lighter. Econ Maybe off. I am younger, but I'm not little anymore. Okay, big guy. Oh, here we go. Going last, brother. Trip. You don't have Just to. Just go before I throw you across. Key, I think. It looks like that wouldn't have made a difference. There's two of them. Uh. Out we go. Trip. Trip! It's all right, y'all! <laughs> Shit. We should go back for him! How? Don't be fucking thick! I can... I can handle this! Oh, shit. Is there any water beneath? Trip! Don't give up! Oh, my God. Can't leave him. We gotta try. We can't just leave him. Y'all head out now. I don't want you seeing oh, this. Drop, no. Motherfucker! Trip! No! Ah! He went out fighting. I hope I do too. I'm sorry about your friend, Javi. 
He seemed like a good guy. The kind of guy you want on your side in a fight. It's priceless. Come on. We're almost there. Looked like it was just water beneath, so he could have survived. He did hit that bit of rebar on the way down there. Or part of playing, whatever it was. Helicopter. I miss when all we did was track the herd. From a safe distance. We need to get down there. We're not getting anywhere without one of those vehicles. It's not like we can just ask all those walkers to move out of the way. How about we make some noise and distract them? We could use that generator. That's a great idea, Gabe. When'd you get so smart, Gabe? You really aren't the same kid I remember. I'm impressed, really. Hey, don't give him too big of a head. He's still got some learning to do. Don't listen to him, Gabe. You're doing just fine. We still gotta get to the generator somehow. Cut a walker open and cover yourself with its guts. Then you can slip right through them. What? Ugh. I mean, please tell me you're kidding. I said please. So, who's gonna do it? Javi, you've been willing to do some crazy stuff for me before. I know shooting Conrad wasn't easy, but it showed me I can always depend on you. Of course, Clem. Look, it smells really bad. Like, way worse than you think. <sighs> Got a massive cut on my arm. Surely I'm the worst candidate for this. Ugh, you'll do. Come here. Never imagine doing this. Holy fucking oh god. Oh I think I'm gonna be sick. Oh this sucks, this sucks, this sucks, this sucks. Do you just literally eat shit all day long? Is that why you smell so bad? Okay. That better be enough. Reach the generator without alerting the muertos. Let this one walk past us. Oh god, there's another. Take a. Okay, can't watch. One. He's kind of staring at me. Ooh. Look how well rendered your face is. Wow.
You did it, Javi. Barely. Now that we're here, we gotta find something to seal the breach with. All we need is the right vehicle. Oh, that's not gonna do the job, man. Yes, it is. What are you doing? The right thing. I'm leaving. We're all leaving. What? And going where? You saw it yourself. We're surrounded by the herd. I'm taking my family out of here. You helped keep them safe, Clem. You're coming too. Let's go. Everyone. We can't wait around. This is bullshit, David. Absolutely not. Everyone in Richmond will die without us. They don't matter, Javi. Don't you get that? This all started the day we knocked on Richmond's door. We brought this on these people, all of us. We can't abandon them. Not after what we've done. We're going home, Kate. Back to the last place we were a family. We're starting over. We're all together again. Finally. It's time. All of us. A new day. A new life. What about here? But what about here, man? Make Richmond our new home. Richmond is gone, Javi. I'm not gonna let the people I love die trying to save a dead dream. I'll go with you, Dad. Gabe! He's my father, Clem. I'm sorry, but he really wouldn't understand. Think this over, buddy. Gabe, is this what you really want? I know it's scary out there, but I have to. You don't have to be afraid, Gabe. I won't let what happened to Mariana happen to you. You have my word. I will protect you the right way. We always hoped you would come back. I wish you'd gotten to know her. Her smile, man, it was, it was like sunshine. I'm not missing another minute with my family now. This is what I want. I, I understand, Gabe. I'm still going back. I won't be able to live with myself if I don't try to help the people in Richmond. You won't be able to live at all if you do that. Richmond is compromised. It doesn't matter if there were five of us trying to save it or 500. We'd all die. I know a losing battle when I see one. We're moving out. Everybody get in. That's an order. How fucking dare you? What will it take, David? What will it take to show you that you do not get to do that? We are not your soldiers. Run away home. Be a deserter. I am done with you. Let's go, Javi. Why the fuck do you think he would go with you? Oh, but he's got all the guts all over his face. Tell him. What the fuck is this? We're in love. I love her, man. We're in love. I should have known. I should have known the night Pa died. The night you weren't there. Blood is worthless to you. Just like he was to you. Just like I am to you. Well, it's time for you to finally learn what blood really means. David! Dad! What do you have to say for yourself? brother. David! Stop I love you. it! I love you. No. No, you don't get to say that. Jesus Christ, stop! You're gonna kill him with kindness. How fucking dare... I love you. No, stop saying that. Stop! Dad, no! Uh, Gabe! Oh my god! You're not taking my family from me! Gabe, no! I'm gonna fucking kill you! I love you, brother. No! Winged him. I think it's time we leave. Javi! Yes? Shutter.
David! But, but Gabe! What the hell is he doing? David took him. We can't wait any longer. We have to go help Richmond. I'm getting on that bulldozer. But Gabe! Gabe wanted to go. He did. We all heard it. You're... You're right. I'm going to save Richmond. Someone has to. I'm with you, Hobby. We can go after Gabe on that motorcycle or go help Kate on the bulldozer. Wherever you go, I go. Ooh. We're out of time. Javi, I'm sorry. I've been here before, more than once. It's not gonna end well for everyone. You have to decide. It's hard to be caught in the middle, I know that. Don't worry about me, Javi, I'll be okay. Help Kate save Richmond. We're running out of time! I can't let Kate go by herself. It's too dangerous. I'm going with Kate to save the city. What about you, Clem? Like I said, I'm with you, Javi. Let's go save Richmond. Then we go Ooh. after Gabe. Then we go after Gabe. If we don't die first. See, we can do both. If we're gonna drive into the herd, we're gonna need these. Side. Can you help us get the gate open? Almost didn't recognize you, Jesus. Once I got in contact with oh, my yeah. people, I headed right back. Had to make sure you folks were safe. I think I'm getting the hang of this. We'll keep the muertos away. Just get me to the gate so I can open it up. I got your back, Javi. Righto. Bang. Bang. Be nice if I was allowed to aim. We're almost there. Javi, get in the basket and I'll lift you to the top of the gate! Basket? The thing in the front! The scooper thing! Whatever! Get in it! Is that like I'll a keep them off you! Cross between a basket and a bucket? Oh no! Under those big tyres you go. Whee! Oh. Yuck! <laughs> Javi, the basket! Right! Yeah, busket. Nice of you folks to drop by. Up, up, up. Come on, Javi. I'll have it open in a second. Couldn't just have open gate button. Uh, green, forward, backwards, left, right, yellow. Definitely not. Big red one. Big red, I imagine, is close. Nothing. No, oh, green. Of course, it's green. You did it, Harvey. Yeah, Bingo. boy. Let's get inside and wrangle the walkers together. If we get them in one group, we can lead them right out. Jesus is kind of cool, huh? Riding in with a sword on his horse, a knight in shining armor. Steam ahead. <laughs> Come on, Harvey. Full auto. Pay attention. There's too many. Try the other setting. <laughs> 
<laughs> Shift and E. They're piling up on the thing. The basket. Shit, I'm empty. Here, take over. The driving or the shooting? Let's plug the bridge with the damn truck. Come on, Harvey. Turn that steering wheel. Beep beep. Fingers crossed. Coming back to, uh, well, not to this. It's just a little surprising. That's all. So glad you came I'm back. I'm just glad you didn't give up on us. Real glad. I gave you my word. Javi, we have to go after Gabe. These guys can take care of the rest of the walkers. Go, Javi. I'll help out here. Okay. Let's go, Clem. Okay, let's go. How are we going to do that exactly? We're going to go back onto the bridge to climb over? Uh oh. when we crash. God damn. David! Fall for me, Javi. Until they... <coughs> but I couldn't. There were so many. I fucked up. After everything you taught me. Oh, it really hurts. You didn't fuck anything up, buddy. You fought as hard as you could. I'm proud of you. Tried. It really did. I know. No, Gabe. No. Do me a favor, Glenn. Gabe, no. Take my cards. What? My playing cards. Grab them. TJJ Uger. Okay. Okay. Has he been bit, or is he just really injured? I meant you. No. We don't want this. Bye, Gabe. Bye, Clem. G give me your gun, Javi. I don't want it. Turn to a... Muerto. Okay. Okay, I don't know if I can let you do that to yourself. And I can't make you guys do it for me. Just give me the gun. 
hers. Hunt me. You... You have to hurry. No. No game. I'll do it. Okay. Okay. You may not be my father, Abby, but you are a great dad. I, I love you, Abby. I love you too, buddy. We never, we never got back at Joan. Still gonna be here somewhere. you help me, Javi. But I can't stop wondering how things might be different if you hadn't. <laughs> Maybe Gabe wouldn't be with Mariana right now. They deserved better, Javi. Better than us. Gabe. Mariana. None of them feel right. Usually the quiet scares me. What about now? There's a lot of work to be done. The herd could come back. Still though, I feel more calm here than... than I ever did in an old van on streets with no streetlights. We earned this, Javi. We earned feeling calm in the quiet. Let's start a family. You and me. A fresh start. What do you say? I think it'd be good for us. It's a bit soon. I don't know, Kate. After everything that just happened, it all feels so soon. Maybe someday. But not right now. Okay. Maybe someday. But don't think I'm forgetting about this one, Garcia. We'll be up there before we know it. Better do something worthwhile in the meantime. Head now? Yes, indeed. We came here to put an end to the raiding. Looks like that's been done. Glad we got it settled. 
Gotta move on. I gotta admit, man, you're a fucking badass. You're a real charmer. Oh, you know that? Through and through. Are you really sure you don't want to stay? There's room. Oh, <laughs> I'm sure there is. But we got other people depending on us, Javi. Just the way it is. I was worried about you, Javi. About who you are inside. You helped save these people, though. That goes a long way for me. Second chances are in short supply these days. That's what this place can be if you let it. Trust me, though. Life within walls is a hell of a lot different than life on the road. Don't take shortcuts like Joan. You gotta do the right thing. Always. Good days, and especially bad. If... if I stay... Oh. Absolutely. The right thing. No matter what. If I stay in Richmond. Good to hear. I read people pretty well. A little gift of mine. You're a capable guy, Javi. Change is in the air here. You can lead that change, and I think you should. For the better. God knows this town could use it. You know what? I'm gonna step up. Lead this place in the right direction. Then as far as I'm concerned, Richmond's in much better hands than it was. Be vigilant. Trouble never stays too far away. You found Asia yet? You're alive. Don't remind me. I'm not gonna say thank you for keeping me alive, but I'm gonna try and find something out there that might make me say thank you. Someday. So where's AJ? Tell me. Where? Do it for Clementine. You know Clem won't rest until she finds AJ. Where is he? Please, man. For her sake. He's in McCarroll Ranch. It's not too far from here. That's... That's where we left him, at least. Thank you. Good luck out there, Doctor. Good luck out there, Doctor. So you're out of here too, huh? Yeah. It's time. I have to find AJ Javi. I've waited so long. But could you do me one last favor before I leave? Wonder what it could be. I used to do this for my niece. That's nice of you. She thought I was terrible at it. Were you? None of your business. I have to see AJ Javi. I have to see that he's okay. Do you think he remembers me? At least a little? Who could forget you? Who could forget you, Clem? No one who knew you, I guarantee it. Yeah, maybe. Everyone told us he was better off. After everything that's happened, I'm starting to think they're right. I don't know if I was a good mom or not. I can't stop thinking about it. Of course you were. Did you love him? With all of my heart. And of course you were. Gabe told me you used to play baseball. I did. I loved it. He told me you fucked it all up too. Yep. Sure did. Well, you survived. I had to. But you loved it. How do you survive that? How? Uh, if you really loved it, how? You get back out there and find something better. There may not be something better out there. You won't know until you step outside. All done. Well, how's it look?
Yeah. You know what? I'll grab your hat. <laughs> <laughs> I remember this team. Your dad ever teach you about baseball? No, not really. Well, you come back, and I'll tell you all about it. It's a deal. If I bring AJ back with me, will you teach him too? You bet. He belongs with you, Clementine. Bring him back. She's all grown up. Your experience with David was dysfunctional. You accepted David's hand after he punched you on the night your father's died. You tried to leave Richmond without David. Uh, in his time of need, you distracted yourself from David. Um, shall we mute that? So I guarantee that's probably going to be uh, copyrighted. Um, your experience with David was dysfunctional. You accepted David's hand after he punched you on the night your father died. You tried to reach, leave Richmond without David. Uh, in his time of need, you distanced yourself from David. Your experience with Kate was mixed signals. Uh, I attribute this to... They didn't really give us the foundation for a loving relationship. At the start, like... I guess it's just up to the player. I didn't see it to start with. Um, you were relieved to see you were relieved to see Kate alive at the junkyard. You supported Kate's plan to escape Richmond. You told Kate that you wanted a future with her. You dismissed Kate's idea to start a family. I mean, it was too soon. You know, your other family has just died. Let's start a new one. Your experience with Gabe was protective. Uh, you made Gabe happy by agreeing to stay in the trailer for the night. You hid the truth about Gabe's neighbourhood friend. You helped Kate save Richmond before going after Gabe. You shot a bitten Gabe to prevent him from turning. So he was bitten. I, I didn't see a bite. A new frontier story, okay. Trip is dead. Eleanor is alive. Uh, you reassured Trip by promising him you wouldn't cause trouble in Prescott. Then you went to the junkyard with him. In the end, Trip saved your life on the overpass despite you not choosing him to be saved. So I wonder, cause, so the very first episode, is it the first episode? You were in jail and you could either go with Eleanor at night or with Trip in the day. So I wonder if, depending on this first choice, maybe their roles would have re reversed and Trip would have been a bit of an arsehole and Eleanor would have been a bit more on your side. Um. Yeah, because Eleanor tattled on us to Joan. Never found out what happened to Joan. I don't know. Maybe she'll pop up in season four. Ultimately, you did not forgive Eleanor for her betrayal. Um, Ava or Lingard. Clem took Ava up on, on the offer to join the New Frontier. Uh, we convinced Ava to help us after she caught us stealing guns. We picked Ava to live, but Joan shot her to teach her a lesson. So yeah, again, I wonder if that would have been reversed. Clem ignored Lingard's medical advice regarding AJ. We refused to give Lingard a lethal injection. After the chaos, Lingard told you uh, where AJ is located. Conrad and Jesus. Uh, we coached Francine through Conrad's poker game. Then Gabe threatened Conrad, we convinced. 
your nephew to lower the gun after we shot Conrad in the tunnel after he threatened Gabe's life. Jesus, we met him, trusted Jesus, didn't leave his behind his hands. We promised Jesus to always do the right thing in helping Richmond survive, which we did. Uh, lastly, you promised Jesus you would help him lead Richmond. Joan, yeah, we don't know what happened. Um, we told Joan about the new frontier was to blame for Mariana's death. Uh, we brought Max to expose Joan to the Richmond Council. Currently, Joan's whereabouts are unknown. Uh, so Clint kicked us out for stealing gas. We took Clint's deal and spared Joan's life. We shot Clint on stage after, well, we didn't, David did. So, could it be? So, other endings would have been uh, we wouldn't have taken up Clint's deal and shot Joan. So, Joan would be dead, cross through Joan, and maybe Clint would be alive. And there we go. There we have it. That's the end of the game. Um, oh, quick. you, AJ. Woohoo! Good. More Clem. More Clem. Okay, there we go. That season was different. Obviously, it focused on a new group of people. It brought Clementine back into it, which, which I'm fine with. Um, I really did like the story. I think here there are a lot more um maybe a lot more changes in what you could choose if you chose one thing it would ultimately go in a a, a different direction on the bigger picture it always feels to me that sometimes in these games it doesn't really matter what what you choose because regardless the the story has to be the same at the end in order for the next game to follow on um I did think it was a, a total, total cop-out to just kill Jane and kill Kenny, depending on your choice, in the first episode, just in a flashback. Oh, yeah, they're dead. Clem's on her own. You, they're dead. Thought it was a bit of a cop-out. Um, overall, yeah, so overall, love the story. Um, I think the gameplay was lacking a little bit. It was a bit too... Press this button, press that button. In the first game... When you're in the pharmacy, for example, there's it's very much like walk around. Oh, we found this remote. Don't know what it does, but we'll keep it. Batteries um, later on. Oh, we can throw a brick, turn the TV on. That distracts the walkers. It's it's like a big puzzle that you solve, and I really like that about the first game. That isn't really the case here. It's kind of walk around. You can pick this up. That's the the one thing you pick up, and that's the one thing that you need to get out. It. It seems a little bit lacking in in that sense. But either way, really enjoyed the game. Um, looking forward to see what they do with Season 4. It is the final season, so it is going to be the ender. Um, I'm going to hazard a guess now before I even start and jump into Season 4. It's going to be kind of parallel to Season 1. Clem's going to find AJ, like Lee found Clem. And it's going to run through that thing. And I I think that maybe Clem might die at the end, leaving AJ on his own. And then, sort of, you know, the cycle cycle continues. Um, I hope that's not the case, but who knows? Who knows? Well, well thank you very much for watching. Um, if you'd like to see more, then please subscribe. Please hit the follow button. Leave me a comment in the below. Were your choices any different to mine? Um, and yeah, join me. Join me next time for season four, the final chapter. See where Clem goes from here. So, 
Thanks very much for watching. Take care, and I'll see you soon.